Well, hey everybody, it's me. Um, just here with a quick update after my um, first surgery post-op doctor's appointment yesterday. Um, I have to say uh, the ride up and back was um, harder than I thought it was going to be. Um, I'm doing better in a car for sure, but I um, definitely feel every bump still. Um, and it's uh, still a kind of a task to uh, go for a car ride, especially one that's a couple hours each way. Um, but uh, our family friend Lynn drove me and my dad up there yesterday. And, you know, it was an hour and 45 minute ride for a 15 minute appointment, if it was that long. It was pretty quick. Doctor checked uh, all my incision incision points. Just asked a few questions about how I was doing and uh, kind of updated me and pretty much where he thinks I should be. Um, <clears throat> think he was not surprised, but uh, I don't know. It's hard to tell with with him. He's very. Uh, I like him. He's a very to the fact kind of guy. Uh, I told him about my eating problems when I had the um, uh, feeding fluid fiasco here a few days ago. Um, he kind of shrugged it off and treated it kind of as a bump in the road that a lot of people come into contact with. So uh, definitely no reason to panic and I seem to be uh, over that now. Seem to be back to my uh, getting my calories. Um, still struggle. I'm still learning how much I can eat at a time and stuff like that. But um, you know, we're getting there. And um, he did tell me that it was going to be a full two to three months probably before I felt anything close to normal. Uh, he said, you know, you had a lot of stuff done. I kind of told him my expectations versus reality story. Um, and that my expectations were after two weeks, I was going to be pretty much good to go. And he kind of chuckled and told me that he said, it's going to be probably a full two months before you really feel like doing much. And he said, probably three months before you really kind of are feeling even close to normal. So, um, I don't know, good to know that I'm on track with kind of where he thinks I should be. Um, he said I can drive uh, if I want, uh, keeping in mind I'm still on pain meds and probably shouldn't do a lot of driving if I've just taken pain meds um, or are on significant amounts. Uh, I am down to two pills every six hours and probably tomorrow I'll switch that to one pill every four hours and then we'll go one pill every five and then one pill every six and then I should be off of them by then uh, still at mom and dad's um, for the foreseeable future uh, at least for this week probably the next week uh, August 1st I have more I go back for another follow-up with him I'll go see my oncologist and that same week I will actually see my regular uh, family doctor as well. So hoping to be back in the North Carolina, Charlotte area uh, first week of August. So maybe I'll get to see some, some of you guys. Excuse me. I'm burping. But that's my update for today. Thanks everybody for tuning in. Uh, it was a good, good follow-up visit and uh, hopefully we just keep making progress. Um, Thanks for always stopping by and comments and support and um, all the love. Love you all. See you soon, I hope. More later.